Hello, everybody, and welcome to Golf Week at the U.S. Amateur Championship here at Chambers Bay. I'm Asher Wildman, alongside this year's winner, Peter Uline. I don't know if I should say congratulations or happy birthday. Wh which one's the golf etiquette? Oh, man, either. Either's perfect for me right now. It's It it's, feels pretty special. So. Well, Peter, happy birthday. It's your 21st year, the U.S. Amateur Champion. Tell us, how does this feel? And I'm talking about the championship. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I mean, it feels great to you know, join the list of winners and be a part of that group. is pretty special. You know, it, it hasn't sunk in yet, so um, hopefully it will, and, you know, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. It was a tough match against one of your college friends, David Chung. He plays at Stanford. You're at Oklahoma State. What was that like going up against somebody you know a lot about? Yeah, um, I mean, David's obviously a great player. You know, we have a good relationship. We go way back. You know, I knew it would be a tough match because he was probably the hottest player coming in. You know, I was just fortunate enough to take take advantage of some of his mistakes today, and, uh, you know, I made, made a good birdie coming down the stretch, and, uh, you know, it's... It is what it is. David played great. So, Well, Peter, like I said, great fought-out victory today. And let's take a look now at your championship run right here at Chambers Bay, brought to you by Golf Week. I'm sad to say, ladies and gentlemen, that this is the last time Ron and I are going to be talking here at Chambers Bay for the U.S. Amateur Championship. Ron, I, I don't think I want to leave this place. I know. It's been a great week. And, you know, right now, Asher, the sun's shining. It's a beautiful day out here. And, but all, th all good things have to come to an end. All good things do have to come to an end. But, hey, what a great finish it was here. Yes, David Chung versus Peter Uline put on a tremendous show. But, Ron, for Chung, it just looked like he couldn't recover the way he has previously throughout the week. No, you're right. He, I mean, he just never could really get things going. He uh, even admitted he, he came out flat and just never could get momentum going. You know, I, I thought I had a lot of good putts out there, but you know, my speed, I guess, wasn't consistent enough to rely on. And, you know, I, I had a little trouble reading the greens today. So, you know, it just wasn't my day really, but uh, Peter, Peter played fantastic too. So it was a good match and, you know, I have a lot to be proud of still. You know, but he did, he, he put up a fight you know, hold out and you know from a fairway, made some key birdie putts. Uh, it was just it was a great match. And not to take anything away from our champion because he did play better and what a performance uh, it was by Peter Uline this week. Yes, it was. I mean, all week he played great, and today especially he played great. Uh, you know, when when uh, Chung would birdie, Peter would match him for a birdie. Sure. Chung birdies and Peter Eagles. So Peter played fantastic. I mean, he's a definitely a deserving champion and. <clears throat> even though uh, I didn't pick him and you didn't pick him. Obviously, winning the U.S. Amateur is the it's the biggest amateur event in the world, and uh, you know it's just a lot of hard work and uh, you know countless hours, you know, practicing and playing, and you know it's it's 
like I said, it hasn't sunk in yet. It's, it doesn't it doesn't feel real, it, but uh, you know I'm definitely gonna enjoy it and uh, you know definitely take this one you know, for the rest of my life. So. All right, Ron. And then what are our final thoughts here on Chambers Bay, the golf course? How do you think it played for a championship stage? I think it played well. Uh, you know, especially for a, a first time, you know, hosting a, a major championship like this. Uh, and yeah, it was a, a tune-up for the 2015 U.S. Open. I think the USJ learned a lot about the golf course, uh, that they'll do a lot of you know their homework and get it really going for 2015. And I think it was just a, a, a great venue for this uh, amateur championship. All I'm gonna say is 500 plus yard par fours. No, 70, <laughs> 700 yards. yards, seven and a half mile walk. I drive that far and I get tired. <laughs> <laughs> well, Ron, like I said, what a great week. What a great champion it was for Peter Uline. By the way, his mother says, don't ever pick him again in your life whatsoever. And that's Just what, what Peter says, too. <laughs> so to our champion, happy birthday is in order. Yes, happy birthday, Peter. There you go. So for Ron Balicki, I'm Asher Wildman. So long, everybody, for Golf League right here at the USA Amateur Championship at Chambers Bay.